Hey guys, it's me, Happily Naomi, and welcome back to my channel. So, in today's video, I think I may have a dupe for you. Not an exact dupe though, but they come pretty close, and I'm going to be testing out these dupes on my face. If you aren't familiar, Tarte has a contour palette that they released with makeup artist Makeup Shayla, and this is the limited edition Tartus and Makeup Shayla palette. And this is what the palette looks like. You have six shades, you have um, basically like a banana color shade to set um, like maybe your under eye area. You got two highlighting shades, you got two contour shades right here, and then you also have a blush. Now the dupe that I have is also a collaboration. This is the Pixie and Miriam Macolage. I don't know if I'm pronouncing her name right, and I'm not. I'm so sorry. This is the Pixie and Miriam. Um, this is the highlight and contour palette, and this I believe got released in January of this year. But this is the contour palette contour and highlight palette. This also has six shades. You have a light banana yellow color. It's a, it's lighter than, or it's just like a different shade of yellow than it is in the Tardis and Makeup Shayla palette. You also have what looks like a highlighting blush. You have two highlights. Well, this looks like a highlight and this just looks more of like a shimmery bronzer. And then you have a cool toned contour shade, a warm toned contour slash bronzer shade. So these are the palettes side by side. I'm going to zoom you guys in a little bit closer or bring the product up a little bit closer so that you can see them for yourselves. And if you guys can hear that running noise in the background, I'm really sorry. That is the AC that's it running in my apartment and it's annoying so <laughs> if you, if I, I know if I can hear it like you guys can probably hear it so I apologize in advance so now that you've gotten a closer look at these palettes side by side I'm going to kind of test them out on my face to see if they really are a dupe for each other starting off with the pixie and Miriam palette and I'm using that darker shade to go in with my contour I am not the best contour queen around but I am really just trying to showcase the color and the shade ranges with both of the palettes and just comparing them side by side. So I'm adding a little bit of this contour to my forehead and my cheek. And I'm going to be blending that out just a little bit because I am going to be going out in public after this. So next I'm going to take that banana yellow shade and I'm going to use that to highlight a little bit underneath my eye. I kind of thought about it and I probably shouldn't have done my makeup first and then do this comparison swatch, but it's okay. So then going into the Tarte palette, I'm taking that darkest contour shade, I believe it's contour shade number 4, and I'm going to be also applying the contour to my face. I didn't have two different brushes to use, but I did wipe my brush in between each use. Next, I'm going to take that banana shade from the Tarte and Makeup Shayla palette, and I'm going to highlight underneath my eyes. And then for the Tarte side, I'm going to go in with that pink blush. And you can see that it's a matte blush on my face, and I'm just using my Morphe E4 brush to apply this. And then I'm going to wipe off that brush, and I'm going to use it on the other side, the pixie side. And you're going to see when I apply this to my cheek, it's so glowy. <laughs> it's so bright, and it, it just does not work as a blush for me. <laughs> So I ended up fixing it by going in with the Tarte palette blush and I just put it on that side because I couldn't just like go out looking like that. So yeah, you can definitely see the difference. <laughs> So as you could see during the demo, um, 
The blush from the Pixi palette was definitely a bit more of a highlighting, glowy powder kind of blush versus the blush that was in the Tarte palette, which is more of a matte blush. So I'm also going to be inserting some swatches into this video as well so that you can see the comparisons of the palettes swatched on my skin. So as for these palettes, both of these palettes are dark skin friendly. Um, they def The under eye setting powder is really nice under both of the eyes. So the cons of both of these palettes, and it's the same con, is that they're both uh, limited edition palettes, but I'm hoping that Tarte keeps the Makeup Shayla palette around and I hope that Pixie keeps this Miriam palette around because these are definitely winners. This one retails for $22 and this one retails for $45. So if you are looking to try any of these contour palettes, I would suggest you go for the lower priced one because you'll still get that same quality in the palette that you're looking for and it will essentially do the same thing. Alright, so that completes this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, you guys!